The former Man United midfielder has not held back with these comments in the wake of Solskjaer's side's 4-0 defeat to Everton at Goodison Park. Manchester United succumbed to a 4-0 hammering at Everton on Sunday and the fallout from that defeat has been significant. Former Manchester United star Gary Neville went on a rant post-match but avoided naming players individually. However, that was not the approach of fellow ex-United player Paul Inns who was speaking about the clash on BBC Radio 5 Live. Ince was made to run through the starting lineup and substitutes bench against Everton and asked which ones he would keep. Here are Ince's responses below when prompted on each individual mention. David the GEA. All day long. Chris Smalling, yes. Phil Jones, no. Victor Lindelof, he's got better. I think you can work on him. Diogo Dalot, he's still a young player. Nemanja Matic, no. Paul Pogba, on his day, yes. I would probably keep him. Fred, no. Romelu Lukaku, no. Dot Anthony Marshall, no. Marcus Rashford, Rashford all day long. He's Manchester United through and through. He loves Manchester. Ashley Young, Young has been a great professional. We all have to move on eventually, though. Dot Scott McTominay, a young kid who will improve. Dot Andreas Pereira, another young player. Arsenal's hopes of securing a return to the Champions League took a major hit on Sunday as they suffered a 3-2 loss at home to Crystal Palace. Christian Bentec put the visitors ahead inside 17 minutes with his first goal in a year and, after Misat Ozil equalised, Arsenal shipped two more goals. Within eight minutes, goals from Wilfried Zaha and James MacArthur gave Palace a 3-1 lead and they held on to all three points to confirm their Premier League place for next season. After a run of three clean sheets in a row, Arsenal were less than impressive defensively at the Emirates Stadium and one of the main culprits was Shkodran Mustafi. Yunor Emery restored the German to his starting 11 but his defending in the build-up to Palace's second goal was simply bizarre and somewhat inexplicable. Mustafi didn't play in either of Arsenal's Europa League wins against Napoli, with the trio of Socrates, Captain Laurent Kosciolny and Nacho Manriel being preferred. He did start Monday's 1-0 victory at Watford, but that was as a right-back, and he was back in Emery's central defensive three on Easter Sunday. With the game in the balance at 1-1, 27-year-old Mustafi produced a truly critical error which resulted in Roy Hodgson's Palace regaining the lead. As you can see further down the page, a free kick was lofted up the pitch and Bentec's header led to a chase for the ball between Mustafi and Zaha, 